The Maricopa County Board of Supervisors gives the green light to build a new animal shelter. And Maricopa County Animal Care and Control tells us it could not have come at a better time. Fox 10's Danielle Miller has a story. She joins us live. John and Christina, the Maricopa County Animal Care and Control was just awarded $27 million to build this new shelter. Uh, we are told that this has been in the works for several years. It is finally moving forward. Taking the place of this empty land will soon be the new Maricopa County Animal Care and Control East Valley Shelter. Monica Geary with the shelter is hoping to break ground in the fall. It's on county land at Baseline and Lewis, and so we already demolished the existing building that was there. I think that was done in 2019, and the architectural plans were also done and approved. So right now, those plans will go out to bid for our construction companies. The Board of Supervisors will then review those bids. The money has been allotted in the 2022 budget to build the $27 million brand new state of the art facility in the East Valley. This new facility will replace the shelter near the 101 in Rio Salado. This is something Geary says had to happen. It was built in 1991. It is just not up to national standards or our standards anymore. So um, we just we really, really needed it and we're excited to get started. We wish we could have it today. <laughs> Judging by the amount of animals processed in the area, Geary says the new shelter will take stress off of the Phoenix location. We processed about 7,000 pets, dogs and cats in prior to the pandemic in the East Valley. So we know that there's a huge need. We know that the East Valley is growing in size. We have a huge volunteer base that's also based in the East Valley. And this location you see right here on Rio Salado in the East Valley, uh, this location has been closed since the pandemic hit. Unfortunately, they just had to reopen it uh, for some uh, limited capacity levels here, but that is because the Phoenix location is at full capacity. Reporting live, Danielle Miller, Fox 10 News.